what is going on guys we are back with some more dragon ball z Dokken Battle videos um i am quite tired so this is probably gonna be a very lazy video i'm uh, probably gonna have a very lazy thumbnail i just want to get the video and go to bed because i'm very very tired guys so i'm sorry that this is kind of a rush but uh jp has quite a few cool things coming through with the introduction of Dokken Battlefield 2.0 so that should be dropping quite soon but they have this whole campaign going on and we're gonna check it out so that's just some cool things you can do like some daily missions uh we do have some special events and some older events come back that's gonna be pretty awesome so uh, right away we have a login bonus so if you log in you know you get some you know rewards and everything uh this does start from i think the 28th uh which is actually tomorrow till the 20th of march there we go yeah 28th which is actually tomorrow uh so pretty much a month right uh, you know three weeks in like a day or something so uh quite a long time to get your login rewards and everything uh daily missions special power up campaign daily missions details down below so we'll look at that a little further uh there are special you know details down below as to what these things actually mean i'm excited for this because the story event to returning with raditz i never farmed when he first came i just didn't care about the unit uh he's actually a very 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 good free to play card he actually aoe's when he supers and i think his pass is like he gets like 40 percent when he's fighting two or more enemies he gets an additional 40 percent attack up so something along those lines uh pretty decent card I wish he had his own free orbs, that will make him quite busted, but, well, not busted, but it'll make him so better, but he doesn't have free orbs, so, um, but nonetheless, still a pretty decent free-to-play card, uh, not really world tournament killer, because he can't really one-shot 20 times or even 10 times, but, you know, a pretty good option if you do want to do the world tournament if you're completely free-to-play. Uh, all Dokken events will be open during the campaign period, so you can uh, do any Dokken event any day of the week, I mean, it doesn't matter, like, you can do... Super Vegito AGL on, let's say, a Wednesday when it's Intelligence Day. So, all Dokken events will be open. So, it's pretty cool between these two time periods. Um, this is already established. So, this is already continuing. Like, it's actually going on right now. So, I think it might have extended, honestly. I think this is supposed to end on the 3rd of March, possibly. But it's now extended. I believe that's the case. If not, then just don't mind me. Um, revamp. Okay, I like this. This is a very, very old event. And it really need updating because it just didn't really have much of a purpose. I mean, yeah, like you can train your characters once a day and get quite a bit of experience. Now they're actually going to revamp it to where it's going to be uh, a bit more meaningful. Now I don't know what they're going to do with the revamp. Um, I assume perhaps maybe uh, let it be every day because um, right now you can only do it once a day. And once again, it gives you like training items, uh, awakening medals. It gives you support items. It gives you quite a bit of experience for your cards. But I mean, like me, I don't even do the event per day. Like it's not really much of an incentive so i hope they give us like maybe more rewards when you do it uh maybe more experience uh that'll be quite cool uh we do have the introduction of four times rank so i do need to rank at 400 right now i'm actually at rank 374 i believe so this is going to be come back on the 6th of march so your boy will get to rank 400 so if you guys have not rank up on jp then make sure you get that done because very very important stuff right there uh moving now special missions uh so this is the daily missions here so daily and we also have some weekend missions as well so Daily clear training with Roshi every day. You get one platinum tur one platinum turtle shell of each uh, each color. Uh, sorry, guy, very tired, so please don't mind me. Um, daily uh, clear Hercule tournament. Uh, get one gold Hercule statue. Okay, pretty cool right there. Uh, clear training in the clouds. Basic awakening medals. Okay, basic. Uh, clear any stage three times. One Z sword each type. One Kai planet training location of each. Well, not each type, but one Kai planet training location. Okay, pretty cool. Uh, Saturday, clear a Dokken event one time. You get one Supreme Kai medal. Okay, that's pretty cool. And then, I guess, you know, on Sunday, you get the Alakai, and then you get Dragonstone. So, okay, that's, uh, you know, pretty good. Pretty good stuff right there. I mean, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll get the uh, dailies done everything. So, I get my uh, bit of training items and my awakening medals and everything. So, I'll take that. Uh, here are some special missions as well. So, clear a Dokken event once. You get one Dragonstone. Clear a Dokken event three times. One Dragonstone. Clear a Dokken event five times. And yada, yada, yada. Uh, clear it up to 20 times. You can get an... Elder Kai. So very valuable. Elder Kai's are always something that well, we need more of because every unit that drops doesn't have farmable super attacks. So, you know, is you need Elder Kai's for those cards. Uh, even when cards are farmable, the farm is just so bad. You might as well use cards either way because you use so much, you know, items to train them up and everything. So, yeah, Kai's are always needed all the time. Uh, Z Waking one character. You know, get basic training items. Uh, well, awakening medals, I should say. So, yeah, just uh, some very, very quick stuff. So, very cool stuff, guys. Uh, this is actually the beginning of the Dokken Battlefield campaign once again. So, the mode will be returning. I have no idea when the actual date is. I don't know that information, guys. But it should be 
within the week or two we should have i think it was actually isn't it like the 16 like the mid like mid um mid month i think there's actually uh a news post right now that's going to be ending i think on the 14th or 15th of march so people are speculating that's going to be dropping after that period uh we don't have the actual concrete date but it's around that time period where we will get the reintroduction to Dokken Battlefield. So cannot wait for that, guy. That's going to be quite cool. So they have a little campaign going with it to celebrate. So I hope they're going to be waking on uh, new cards. I hope we have some very OG cards. Like, for example, I think they should awaken, like, you know, uh, the uh, Toa, Mira, awaken Demigra. Um, there's a lot of old cards, man. They can awaken with this, uh, you know, their introduction Battlefield. So I hope they get that done. And um, I would love for them to bring back the Extreme Z Awakening of HL Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Because I didn't farm the man all the way. Mine's actually, uh, I think he's at level 130. So I need to do a little bit more to get him all the way up to level 140. So I need to bring the, uh, the Extreme Z Awakening back. So anyways, guys. So very, very, very quick video. Uh, Dokken Don't Battlefield will be a thing quite soon. 2.0. So that's actually quite hype. So if you guys are hype, let me know down below in the chat. Uh, very quick, small, short news video. Nothing much to talk about, guys. Because, you know, I just... Want to get out for you guys real quick because, you know, the boy's tired. I had a very long day uh, getting some stuff done on the down low. I'll probably gonna make a video about that later on. But, you know, for now, just, you know, talking about Doka and everything. So, uh, anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the video, if you did, leave a like, share, comment down below. If you're not subscribed, make it a thing. Sub to the boy. I'll see you in another video. Thank you once again. Bye-bye.